Welcome to Swenson Granite Works, quarrying and manufacturing quality cut granite since 1883. Swenson Granite Works has always relied on teamwork, dedication, and a desire to produce the finest quality granite products. In the early days, hundreds of workers were required to extract the granite from the top of Rattlesnake Hill in Concord, New Hampshire. In fact, a large percentage of Concord's population was employed in some form or other by the Swenson Company. From humble beginnings and a mountain of work, Swenson Granite Works has evolved to satisfy an ever-changing marketplace. During World War II, Swenson Granite retooled their sizable production plant to produce strong steel mesh used in the production of submarine netting in support of the war effort. The face of the quarry has evolved as well, and today managers and engineers take great pains in planning and establishing the direction that granite extraction will take all in an environmentally responsible fashion. The purity and graining of the granite shelf are important factors in deciding where to quarry the granite so that the utmost quality and least amount of waste is achieved. It's a delicate balance that we're constantly working to improve upon to ensure responsible management of the resource. Holes and slots are burned and drilled into the vertical and horizontal faces of the bedrock. Once the horizontal holes reach the required depth, they're packed with explosives, including dynamite and primer cord, in order to free the intended ledge from the bedrock formation. Once the holes have been packed and rechecked for proper hole depth and safety, all surrounding equipment and personnel are moved to the proper distance away from the square of ledge about to be blasted free. The massive block, averaging over 110 tons, is now ready for the next step. The newly freed granite mass now needs to be cut into smaller blocks in order to fit them under the saws at our production plant. A series of holes approximately six inches on center are bored into the granite block. Then metal splitting wedges and shims are inserted and driven deep into the holes with a heavy sledgehammer. As the wedges are driven into the stone, a fracture line is sent down through the stone and slowly a line forms, linking each hole, causing the block to split where intended. With the aid of cranes and heavy machinery, each smaller block, averaging 10 feet by 5 feet by 5 feet, is carried away from the wall and stockpiled for shipping to our production plant. Our dedicated quarry crew takes pride in a job well done. Blocks taken from the quarry are inventoried and stockpiled at our 100,000 square foot production facility in Barrie, Vermont. Large fork trucks carry these blocks into the saw building to be set up on one of our huge 11 foot 6 inch diameter diamond tipped saws. The first step toward a finished product involves sawing a block into slabs of the required thickness. Computer guided saws work 24 hours a day making many passes for each cut, one half inch deep per pass. Too fast, and the blade can warp, and cuts can become inaccurate. On average, it takes two and a half hours to saw just one slab from a block. Every saw operator programs the computer to cut each block to specific thicknesses, and regulates how fast the blade will travel. Extensive use of water is critical for safety and quality. Each slab now has a smooth top and bottom surface, and depending upon its usage, will be further finished to meet specifications. Slabs destined for use as steps are thermaled with a high temperature flame, creating a non-skid surface. One time-honored process is rock facing, still done by hand with a hammer and chisel to produce a rugged and bold finish. The most common edge finish is split face, which is a rough surface created by applying hydraulic pressure to the top and bottom of a slab until the piece pops or splits on a line. Individual workstations are created for each finishing type. Specialized machinery aids the production crew in grinding and polishing surfaces and even sawing angles. All of the work requires a steady hand and knowledge of the characteristics of the granite being worked on. Overhead cranes are a must in the production plant to keep the flow of material moving in the right direction and making sure that product reaches all of the areas it needs to go to, quickly and safely. Inside, the dedicated staff serves as the central nervous system for the production plant, assuring that proper communication reaches the right people on the plant floor. At our many Swenson Granite Works retail locations, photographs and thoughtful displays give you a hands-on education into the various uses for granite and stone. 
from long-lasting steps and edging products on the outside to warm additions to any interior decor, we can make all your projects come to life. And we can deliver it right to your door. Walk into Swenson Granite Works and let us help you. Strengthen your entrance and spruce up your landscaping with our beautiful granite and stone products. From our quarry to your home or business, we have what you need to complete all your projects and the experience and know-how to help you get it done right. The uses of granite and stone are almost as endless as our supply. So go ahead and tell us your dreams. We'll help to make them a reality. Using modern crane trucks, our experienced drivers install thousands of steps per year and every set starts with proper pad preparation. We build our sets from the ground up, taking care to be sure each layer is level and allows for proper water runoff. Finishing touches are applied to be sure all pieces fit as precisely as possible. Your granite steps from Swenson Granite Works will last forever and afford you a lifetime of maintenance-free enjoyment. Thank you for visiting Swenson Granite Works. Do it once. Do it with stone.